Good evening. My name is Tony Craig. My nonprofit organization that I'm doing is Capital Foundation of Huntsville, also known as Capital League. All right, about the program. It was incorporated by the state of Alabama in 2008. It received its 501c3 in 2009. Adopted Capital League by 2010, although Capital League was established in 2003, they had to adopt them in order for them to also become you know, a nonprofit organization. And they serve um, the Huntsville, Madison County, um, and surrounding areas of North Alabama. Their mission, well, their mission is to pretty much empower you know, the grade schools of elementary, middle, and high school young men to help guide them to greatness and keep them on the right path of making sure they complete school and get them to college. And the five words that you know they always teach them about is self-identity, training, competition, social community service, and health education. All right, services that they provide. Well, for the first one of many services that they have to offer is educational workshops. A Friday after, um, a Friday of the month of February, they'll have their annual lock-in, which is they have the um, boys come spend the night you know, at the hotel, I mean, at the church that they meet at. And they'll basically have educational workshops as far as learning how to manage money, learning how to keep money, learning how to um, pretty much manage school, you know, dealing with the sport that they, you know, they're playing. And just also learn how to, you know, go about society in, in ways. The next thing is college tours. Um, during the month of May, They'll pick either a state or any big city that have, you know, surrounding colleges and just go explore out, you know, different options in college so the boys can give a taste, get a taste of, you know, what the college life is like and, you know, pursue of their future goals and what they want to become as, you know, in their major. Third one is Academic Achievement Day. And that also comes in the month of May, not June, matter of fact. And that's where, you know, they have a day where they just recognize, you know, all they, you know, did throughout the whole entire year. And they also get achievement um, rewards for, you know, having good GPAs and, you know, pretty much participating in the um, whole entire program throughout the whole entire year. And along with, you know, what the program is pretty much about is always community service activities throughout um, the school year of when the program is, you know, being know brand so they always be community service worker whether it's like feeding the homeless or you know going out to veterans um grave sites for, for memorial day to put wreaths up there right beside the um gravestone or you know just going out to the um public and you know just helping out for us pick up around a playground or you know just being the leaders the young leaders that they are how can the program be communicated with the help for the donors and you know just volunteers you know you can help them you know improve their uh, schooling by you know providing them with ac more academic resources as far as like either it's textbooks or you know any resource that can help them you know accomplish their goals in the classes that they're taking throughout you know the whole entire school year also um, with you know the help donation and volunteering you can help with um, feeding the homeless and you know also help provide them with food drives that they do with families during Thanksgiving where they go to Kroger and buy a lot of food as far as Thanksgiving turkeys you know macaroni all that good stuff that you would have for Thanksgiving and go out to families in need and you know provide them with a good Thanksgiving meal and then like I said in the last slide about putting reefs up, you know, by veterans' graves on Memorial Day to help pay respect to them serving our country. All right, so why did I chose this topic? Well, I was once one of them. I was a capital leader, um, my eighth grade year of middle school and been going strong till my um, 12th grade year in high school. And, you know, with them guiding me through you know, the program and also being able to, you know, guide me to the person who I am today, you know, they helped me want, 
wanted to uh, pretty much become a business major. And they also helped me create the goals into wanting me to own my own business one day. So, you know, I really appreciate them for, you know, just giving me that opportunity to want to be, you know, the person who I am pretty much today is being the leader. So how do you, um, to support? Support, you go to uh, www.capitalfoundationofhuntsville.com and where you'll see at the bottom, there's a donate symbol. You can just donate, you know, however much you want that can, you know, like I said, lead towards the success of the young middle school, high schoolers, and um, elementary. And, you know, with your help and your guidance, you know, giving them just words of encouragement will go a long way with what their mission is of, you know, leading these young men to success.